IU quarterback Nate Sudfeld's time as a Hoosier is coming to an end. The senior will play at Memorial Stadium one final time on senior day this Saturday against number 15, Michigan. Wow, I didn't really think about it, but yeah, I mean, I'm sure it'll start to hit me this week. It's been a, it's been a great ride here at IU so far, but I, there's still a lot of football to play this season. And the fact that it's our last home game, I mean, I'd love to get it as a senior on senior day, but we'll still have two games after that, But so just one, get, one day at a time. IU offensive coordinator Kevin Johns echoed the comments of his quarterback, saying there's still a lot of football left to play this season. Me personally, I've spent a lot of time with Nate. Um, just in my time coaching the quarterbacks, I've had him since day one. And uh, so, yeah, it is hard to, to watch him play his last home game. But for us, we're not even close to having that mindset yet just because we feel like we have so much left to do and left to accomplish uh, and, and work to get the bowl game that, um, to me, it's not really the end quite yet. Despite taking snaps since his freshman year, Sudfeld has just started 22 of his 33 career games, making it even more impressive that he set the school record for career touchdown passes with his 49th score this past Saturday. According to head coach Kevin Wilson, the senior still has a lot of improving to do, and his better days are still ahead of him. At the same time, I think uh, Nate is still, even though it's his last home game, I think he's a young quarterback that has so much improvement that he can make. He's, you know, just, you know, splitting time, the early, the injury he had last year. I mean, he's kind of played about half his career. To me, his best is, uh, I hope, way out in front of him, and, and he needs to have a great week and have a good one this week and as we finish the season. IU fans will have to wait until Saturday afternoon to see whether or not Sudfeld can finish his career in Bloomington on a winning note. From Memorial Stadium, Brent Farkas, Hoosier Sports Network.